Break on through to the other side. Uh, you know, love me two times. All that kind of good stuff. You know who the man is, Mr. Jim Morrison. Some of you may have known that he died in uh, good old Petty here. And they've got him buried actually behind these walls here. This is the cemetery where Jim Morrison and a couple other people like uh, Chopin, which is, I think it's a Polish, or I just know it's that potato vodka that they make. It's really expensive. So let's go inside and see where old Jimbo is. Eighteen oh four. It's been here since. Okay. I don't think we have to worry about a mask on in here. It's, everyone's already dead, so that's okay. So here's the map. Giovanni. That guy lived till 87, good for him. And his wife lived till 99 years old, 1908 to 19, whatever if that said, 99 years later, do the math. Made it out to one of the main roads. It's so quiet here, it's dead here. Yeah, these things, like you could rent one of those out in Vancouver for like 600 bucks, at least 800 bucks a month for a bachelor suite like that. And I'm not walking on the graves, just so you know, look, there is a path. So I don't want to hear that I'm walking on graves. I need, there's probably people buried under here too anyways. Eighteen eighty nine to nineteen fifty seven. Oh, this one's busted down. Someone broke in, or someone broke out. So what I like about these old cemeteries is you can see they're all like very fancy because in Canada like most of our cemeteries nowadays are the flat stones on the ground nobody even gets a tombstone anymore and um, yeah it's unfortunate I wonder how much these people paid for all this stuff 31 to 86 that's a young life there and then 1932 to 2018 so you gotta wonder this is chapel in French, so is Dave Chappelle in French? We got the crematorium. This guy got his own tomb here. Dantoli de la Forge. 19, sorry, 1895. Okay, I believe we're here. So it's all fenced off though. I got lots of people coming to pay their respects, of course. All right, rest in peace, Jimbo. Part of me just wants to jump over this fence. Like, you should be allowed to go over there. It shouldn't matter. I'll probably sneak through somewhere. 
what are they gonna do? Kick you out anyways? I mean see this guy knows we're only here once, you should go for it. You jump the fence, I jump the fence. Come on, let's both do it. What are they gonna do to us? Uh I think not much. Exactly. I don't care what people say. Here he is, the hell with your fence. There it is, Jimbo. Yeah, man, you came the whole way here to see Jim. Come on, man. Yeah. Right? right? Get in there, brother. Take my picture if Absolutely, you want. man. Once in a chance. Right? That's yeah. what I'm saying. I'll try to get these right. I'll do a couple different ones for you. Because we want to get his his nameplate too. Yeah. It's ghosts. You guys saw nothing. Tell me what you think of those, sir. Yes. <laughs> Thanks, man. No worries. I'm a ghost. Woo! Don't worry about it. Thumbnail. All right. There we go. I didn't come all the way to Paris to not go to his grave. I'm sorry. That's the way it goes. And see, look, I started. Look what I started. Go, just go. Go. As long as you're respectful, I think it's okay. Picture's okay, sir? Yes, thanks, man. Right on, man. Good stuff. <laughs> Good stuff. Right? Hey, yeah, we came here. You got to do it. You can't yeah, stay behind yeah, the fence, totally you know? True. Right? Don't be like me, kids, so don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> right on, guys. Take care. All right, bye -bye. <laughs> All right cheers. Hey, that's a good Canadian accent you got there almost. <laughs> Where are you guys from? Netherlands. Hey, I'm heading there afterward. Nice. Ah, where are you from? Canada. 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 Yeah. What's your channel? What's your, what's your channel? A stupid tourist. Yeah. <laughs> right? Absolutely. Yeah. You won't like it though. I'm pretty uh, stupid in it. But that's yeah. the that's the gimmick because too many people are friendly on YouTube and everything's the same and I just need to stand out a little bit different. Yeah. This uh, will do it. Oh yeah, and then I was yelling at the petition ladies at the other monuments, you know, where they say sign the petition, oh, yeah, yeah, stuff yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah. So yeah, I just call out scammers. Yep. Um, the ring scam, yep. you walk by in the ring on the ground. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, so I just yeah, try to yeah. warn people about stuff like that. Yeah. yeah. That's pretty common in Paris. So what are you going to do in Holland? Uh, well, the flight we bought was fly into Paris and out of uh, Holland, out of Amsterdam. So I've been there before, so it's just gonna be a couple days. Not too much. Memory lane. <laughs> Memory lane, yeah. I'm getting older, so not too much partying. But I'm from Vancouver, so we call, uh, we're call we called Vansterdam. Ah. Right? Yes. For similar, you know what I mean? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. With the children listening. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I know what you mean. I know of course. You mean. And they already know a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect. Don't worry. All right. Take care, guys. Enjoy your vacation. Well, that's a wrap here at the old cemetery. You know, I feel bad trying to like take selfies and stuff like that at certain graves, but you know, it's a once in a lifetime opportunity. Well, not once in a lifetime. I mean, I could come back tomorrow. I could come back in four hours. So it's not once in a lifetime. Look at those nice uh, security to keep people out. I guess they're doing a lot of partying in here at nighttime. That's pretty much the end of this one. Obviously we're not in the cemetery anymore. So that's it from stupid tourist thank you for watching stay stupid when you're